Hi, I'm Dewey Hollister, the Executive Director of the St. George Village Botanical Garden, the Botanical Garden of the Virgin Islands. Today I would like to talk about a very interesting tree, and that is the Kapok tree, Seba pentandra, which is native to the Virgin Islands as well as Central and South America. It is our largest growing tree, and it is a very famous tree, particularly historically. The Kapok tree is well known for its fibers and its seed pods. It was used years ago for stuffing mattresses, pillows, and especially used for flotation. So if you're talking about life preservers on the Titanic, almost surely they were stuffed full of Kapok fibers. So I invite you to take a look up in the canopy above me and you'll see the seed pods are opening up with all the fluffy flyaway fibers and seeds that you see up there now. You'll also notice that there's almost no leaves on the tree. We're in the middle of a very dry period of time and the tree periodically will lose its leaves when it's very dry, but it makes it even easier to see the seed pods above me. Now those fibers, let's take a closer look at those. I'm gonna pick up some here on the ground because they're shedding out. And if you can look at this, you see it in my hands. You'll see this, the fluff and you'll see the seeds. See the little seed there? That tiny little seed is gonna grow into another giant kapok tree. And this stuff is very fluffy. You can see how it just flies away. And you know what it feels like? If you've ever picked up like a downy little baby chick or something, that's what this feels like. Super, super silky, just incredibly lightweight. You imagine it flying away on the wind. There's lots of new trees heading off that direction. I'd also like to take a closer look at the base of the tree. It's a very unique growing plant. So come with me over here. And I want to stand here amongst the buttress roots of this tree. And I think you can see why they're called buttress roots. They clearly are helping support the tree and keep it from falling over. It's a little bit of a misnomer to call them buttress. They're really guy wire roots. They keep the tree from going the other way. They don't brace it from coming this way. But they're absolutely amazingly beautiful structures on these trees. Seba pantandra, the kapok, is one of the largest growing trees in the New World tropics. In the rainforest of Central and South America, this tree will get over 200 feet tall and is an emergent species. Emergent means its canopy comes up above the main canopy of the forest, almost like an island in the sky. And I think that's one of the things that contributed to this tree being a sacred tree to the ancient peoples of Central America, the Olmec, the Maya, the Aztecs. And in their belief system, it represents the entire universe. The roots plunging deep into the ground represent the underworld. The trunk of the tree represents the world that we live in as people. The canopy of the tree represents the heavens above. And it's a very symbolic tree for those people. And even to this day, their descendants look at this tree as a sacred tree. This tree is also pollinated by Jamaican fruit bats. So it's a, you could see where that might make somebody think of spirits. Well, I really enjoy you being here and seeing this unique tree, and I can't wait to see you here in the garden next time.